This is the JCHS Studio News. I'm Nikita Page. The high school's annual coffee house event is coming up soon. It will be on Friday, November 17th at 7 p.m. in the cafeteria. Uh, ticket prices have not been yet announced, but they are expected to be around $10. Highlight performances include a beatboxing performance and several student bands. The class of 2012 Council would like to thank Shop Parade, Food Town, Stop and Shop, Carvel, and Blimpies for donating to this event. The Chiefs football team seems to be having a promising season. Here's Bob at the October 30th football game against Week Wake. Thank you, Nikita. Did the Chiefs have a chance of making it to the Giants Stadium this year? I think so. Currently, they are 6-1, and one, and we'll have to see what happens at the end of this game. Thanks there, Bob. And yes, the Caldwell Chiefs are doing absolutely amazing this year. With a record like that, there is no way that they will not make it to the final. This year, the team is stronger than ever. No matter the situation, passing, running, punting, they are destroying their opponents. Let's see one of the highlights from this game. Now let's see an instant replay. With plays like that, it's no wonder that they won that game against Week Wade. Yes, that's right. With a score of 28-7, the Caldwell Chiefs dominated. Now for some more school news. On Friday, October 29th, many students wore their costumes to school. Here's Jeff with two such students. Jeff. Hello, this is Nikita Page reporting on site at James Caldwell High School. Here we have senior John Potato who is dressed as Ernie from Sesame Street. So, Ernie, what gave you the idea of dressing as a character for Sesame Street? Uh, I kind of just saw the costume and said, Oh, that's a great one. So I picked it up. Did you like anything? Did you see any other costumes that you might have been interested in wearing? Um, not really. I mean, I kind of pulled this together last minute. So, I kind of smoked the first thing that caught my eye. And there you have it, folks. Ernie, Sesame Street. All right, here we have uh, Bobby Norgard. He is dressed as a dog. What inspired you to uh, have this idea of dressing as a dog? Rough. And there you have it, folks. <laughs> Rough. And there you have it, folks. <laughs> and lastly, if you haven't picked up a copy of The Cauldron, please do so. If you can't find a physical copy, which are located in the library and the office, please visit the link provided in the description to find an online copy available. This is the JCCS Studio News, Nikita Page, signing